Is this you? There's something that you want to do. Something you want to experience. But you don't do it. Whether it's asking that person out that you have a crush on. Telling that person you have a crush on you have a crush on them. Asking for that promotion that you want in the job. Asking a person to become a client. Is this you? You want to do those things, but then you're afraid of doing it? Then what happens? You stop yourself from doing it. You have all these thoughts coming up for worst case scenarios of what happens by doing it. And you're afraid. You're afraid of doing it. You stop yourself from doing it. And then what happens? Our mind starts beating ourselves up. We start beating ourselves up for not doing that thing. We start beating ourselves up for our life, for the way that it is. We want something different, but we're choosing to do the same thing that's giving us the same results that we have in our life right now. Is that you? How's it feel? How much more do you need to do the same thing again to get those results that you don't like? I invite you, and if you take this invitation, I can help you to shift that and also how to do something different. Let's get present. Let's get present to right now, present to life, honestly. There's a pandemic going on, unknown factors. But what is known is tomorrow's never promised, even for you. And what can happen with these situations, these things we want to experience is we have that same type of fear, like the fear we have for the pandemic of the potential dying from it. We feel like we will die with whatever happens from that for going for what we want. Whether it's a humiliation that reminds you of your childhood experience, shame or whatever, from your previous experiences. Rejection that reminds you of a previous experience. Whatever it may be, there's a part of you trying to protect you from not experiencing that again. And that part of you that's protecting you from going after what you really want is also that part of you that starts to beat you up for not going for what you want. Welcome to the inner conflict. Like I said before, think about the present times. The pandemic. Tomorrow's not promise. What if tomorrow's not promise? What if in that energy you can accept that, but bring that in the present moment as if tomorrow's not promise, all I have is right now. And what do you choose to do? Do you choose to live freely and go for what you want? Or do you want to continue living the limited life and stay in that fear aspects of things? And potential with tomorrow not promise, your today is just fear. It's time to step off that edge. What's the best thing that can happen for you going for what you want and continue to go for the things you want what's the best thing that can happen for you actually going for what you want and stepping over that fear